Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Wasteland 3. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that he shows to join me today. We have some level ups, we have a display case, everything we, we took uh, from there last episode. We also might have some things because I was messing around with keys that open. Oh man, that sound. I hate that particular sound. Um, but uh, yeah, we have some level ups, so we're going to take care of that right away. We're going to go up on luck right there and say confirm to that. And uh, we're just going to go around, see if there's any exclamation marks over there. And there are. And that's the that's it maxing out. And uh, that's it. Okay, good, good, good stuff. Really good stuff. Okay, so. Hmm. Oh. Right. I was under the impression I was over here. I'm not over there. I'm over here. That explains why I didn't find the hostages. Because, yes, there gotta be around. You're fucking dead, you bitch. Just wait until I get out of here. Quiet! Fuck you. I'm gonna cut off your fingers and shove them up your ass. Be silent, or you will lose all fingers. That's Gertrude the Gruesome. Oh, and we can see them. Oh. Oh, Gertrude the Gruesome has more health than a giant uh, Ronald Reagan, Reagan murderous statue. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's the, yeah, the, the health numbers are, are that's, I, it's, um, mm -hmm. they might as well be death claws. Let's go over here first, because maybe we're going to find some death claws. Oh, there you go. We got a... Very nicely tinged pool of blood. Will he survive the gas? Not a chance. As it should be. He is unworthy. Unworthy. Let's get out of there because the, the guy is patrolling. Uh, but the fact that I know they exist might actually trigger them to attack me. It's going to be kind of tricky. And of course, we still have this bit over here that we just haven't found. It's possible that we just go through there, but I find that it's unlikely that it happens like that. Uh, so, I am going to release the hounds or sort of something. Uh, we could go up and, and just minigun them up in the face. I wonder if that would work. I'm going to say it wouldn't. Oh. Ooh, line of sight is a thing. Not too bad. It did some damage. That is very surprising. Why couldn't you... Uh, mm, right. You have line of sight from there, but not from here. <laughs> what? What is the line of sight doing? Is it calculating based off of... Is it lucky? It is lucky. It is lucky that I... Ha oh, that's actually unlucky then. Uh, well, those things are going to blow up, and uh, we can do that no problem whatsoever. Lucia can start the proceedings with Snapshot, potentially. Maybe. S snapshot. Trick shot. Snapshot. Good. Off to a good start. And then, we rally. Not everybody, but we rally. So that's Frozen. What does Frozen do? It do. It definitely do. Uh, Jennifer, she can she can open fire on things, uh, which in this case might get her frozen, which then would allow me to see what it is. It did. So uh, minus action points, minus action points, minus action points. You caught a cold. Mhm. Mm okay. Uh, you murderer. Somebody. That's definitely who we are. Um, unfortunately, it's not very good here. I could, I can't, but I could gain, oh, that's almost enough. That's almost enough. Well, if I'm lucky, that will be enough because of the lucky shot where um, you basically get to shoot for free. That didn't happen, but I'm fine with that. So that guy might be a little bit of an issue. We are going to have 95% chance to hit from here. That is going to be perfectly acceptable. Two criticals in that 
one burst. That is really nice. And then you are going to need a little bit of a four action points, five action points. You don't tell me how many. That's six at least. That's, let's send you over there. You might die. But if you crit... Oh, that's not too bad. It is kind of bad, but it isn't terrible. Because we have Lucia right next door. And that's five action points to move. And uh, let's see. That is a kill for sure. That is not a kill for sure. That is a bad thing is what that is. Snapshot. That's a lucky one. And that's another lucky one. Okay. Are we going to be safe? We got a three action points move over here. Doesn't tell me how many action points over here. Uh, yeah, I don't know why it doesn't. Oh, wait a minute. I don't need for it to tell me up here. I can just look down here. Okay. Redundancy, but it's nice. Okay, so, well, it's three action points that we're going to need to use. If we are do, going to do anything, which it didn't do. We didn't do anything. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so take cover, because somebody's going to die. And don't change our characters automatically, my god. Let's see if I can taunt him with Jennifer. Oh, there's the cat. Ooh, the cats. I forgot about them. They might actually do something. Moving to cover. They are gonna do something. Okay, this guy didn't didn't do, didn't attack. He's just moved move to cover. But yeah, and I'm okay with that. I don't have line of sight from anywhere. That's weird. Uh, let's take you out. Hmm. That was weird that she had so few action points. Wasn't it? Oh, because she's frozen. Of course. There we go. Whew. Not too bad. She did, did take a little bit of damage, but uh, the 5 million health person was uh, taken care of. We got some uh, a key. A freezer key. This small key is engraved with the word, quote, freezer. And also, there is a flare, which looks like uh, a saw. And that's the freezer up here. Oh, that might be where the hostages are. Well, La Loca is there. A woman in ranger gear staggers out of the freezer. She seems to have lost some fingers to frostbite. Yeah, you're uh, rangers from Arizona. You didn't sound. Uh, it didn't, didn't sound that frozen when uh, when you talked before. Yes, well, we came here in the convoy. And it took you this long to come looking for us? Ugh, God's fucking tits. They put me in this freezer to cool off after I kicked Vic in the sack. <laughs> Funny, right? And some greasy, shit-licking chick's been cutting on me for days. Calls herself Gertrude the Gruesome or some such shit. Wait, she's not dead yet, is she? Afraid so, she attacked us. She peers at the corpses on the floor. I see her. Fucking balls. I wanted to murder her. You mean I really wanted to murder her, but you didn't have the chance to re-record that line. Name's Laloka, by the way. Give me a sec to get my shit together and I'll get moving. And once I do, might drop this fucking badge and walk all the way back to Atchison Territory. Atchison Territory. Thank you for letting me know how to pronounce that. I hope I don't forget. Uh, where's that? In Arizona, kids. One of the rail nomad tribes. The better one. Being here is almost like being at home anyway. The way the breathers squabble with Vic and his bargain basement sadists. Why do they call you La Loca? You know, I get asked that a lot. Not sure why. Anyway, Kekaba, asshole who runs the choppers, pissed me off. Don't remember why. Huh. Anyway, I threw a fuck ton of waste wolf shit at them. Ran like hell. But they caught me anyway. Spent a week staked in the sun. Laughed the whole time. You're not doing bad for someone who got tortured. What? This? The missing fingers and toenails and stuff? Ain't nothing. These shitlords are fucking amateurs. I mean, take a finger right away? Where the fuck 
you're gonna go from there that's worse. She shakes her head. I tried to fucking tell him. Look, you gotta build. Slices, cut, gouges. And then you take a finger. If they're still awake. But no, they cut off the finger. With a clean goddamn knife, mind you. And then make me eat it. Like forced fucking cannibalism's gonna break me. I told him. Bitch, I chewed on that knuckle when it was still attached, and I'm pretty fucking hungry right now. Thanks for the dinner, motherfucker. Nod on that pinky all night and ask for seconds. Can we bandage you up? Why? I'm barely fucking bleeding anymore. Okay. We got it from here. Get the safety. Sure. Why not? Right after I raid the kitchen. I'm fucking starving. Nah, you don't know. You don't need that. There's plenty of snacks lying around. It's totally fine. No need for to go to the kitchen. Besides, I don't even know where it is. Also, you were in the freezer, so it kind of either. But whatever. Mile high mug beer or something. Mug feeler. Sure. I don't. Didn't. Mug feeler. Was that actually what it was called? Because that's kind of cool. A cool name for for a thing that you drink because you fill the mug with with the thing and uh, you drink it's it's relatively intu intuitive which i find it weird but that's probably because of that slang an anabolic injector mm -hmm. yeah just for one extra action point eh, so, i mean it's good for the sniper once but yeah i'm good without it hello you are dead unfortunately combat starts even though it shouldn't. Uh, well, I mean... I don't know that it shouldn't, actually. I don't know that the enemy is gonna... Is gonna be able to attack us. Let's defend. I got a plan. I have a plan. And it basically revolves around not letting the, the cats through. Because that 5% evasion is unbelievably powerful. Because that's per action point. And now, they can't... They, I mean, they, they need to move on... Move in so much anyway that it doesn't really matter. And then I kill them when they're right next to me. Instead of moving back and letting the cats move in. Which they tend to be better at, I think, ever since the last few patches. Party Pal didn't, wasn't very good at that, though. Because it, it didn't do nothing. Uh, okay, so these guys have extra armor. Oh, because they're... they're um, Or something. No, that's extra damage is what that is. Oh, because of the energy thing. No, no problem. No problemo. We got ourselves Danny over here with a rally. It affects everybody. That's really nice. Uh, we have a aimed precision strike. Actually, we're going to do the precision strike with this thing. Because we can, uh, let's press shift. Nope, not shift. No, not tab. Shift. Uh, we got a fumer, 700, 800 back there. And that guy is a Nox Bomber over there. So that sounds like a bad time for everybody. So I'm just gonna go ahead and kill you in the head. That didn't... That wasn't... What? Whatever. Uh, we might actually be able to kill you. No, 55 is too bad. And then we take a shot. Oh, there's this guy over here. 71? Nope. Not interested in that. And, uh... How about this guy? That's a 95 over there. Eh. Mm, I find it difficult. Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know how this is going to turn out. We could just set up an ambush. Or rather, set an ambush up. Uh, but I don't know if that is... I don't know what's going to happen here. Heavy weapons. 54. Really bad. Jennifer, you can increase your big guns. You might even be able to read about big guns. What is that? It's nothing. Let's see if you can. If you can, can you? Where's the, where's the thing? There you are. Do we have big guns things? No? We didn't find any? Or maybe we did early in, early in the game and uh, screwed it up. Eh. Yeah, it's fine. It's all good. Uh, that's uh, 64 over here. It's not too shabby. Let's go for it. I didn't expect that to go that way. Oh, we don't have enough action points. 
Okay, not an issue. Uh, we're gonna worry about that in a little bit, basically. Ooh, Horn Strike. Yep. So you can finish off whoever you want. 72, 95, 95 over there. Let's go for it. Very nice. So that one dies the moment it moves or something. I'm not 100% sure how that's gonna turn out. Uh, that one over there is gonna need a little bit more incentive for this. Fortunately, I'm landing all my shots and actually it was for free. Okay, that's another kill over there, at least hopefully so. And then we have our pistols that need to take care of the ones that are really close. And that's you taken care of. Um, that guy... So, actually, you, you know what? Uh, our damage that we do with this thing isn't great enough for some of these values. That's good enough. And uh, we're going to do ambushes here. That guy needs a little bit more... Can I, do I have line of sight? Yes, I do. 72. That's good enough for a aim shot. And fortunately, it wasn't very good. But we don't mind. At least I don't think so. 85. Good enough. And then you can't do much. Just gonna save your action points. It's totally fine. Eyes so. on target. Oh, yeah, that guy is the first one to move in. I screwed it up. Okay. <laughs> Jennifer did something there. Gas grenade. That's bothersome. And that's pretty bad as well. Okay. Yeah, uh, 65 over there. Yeah, it's pretty bad. This is, uh... Bad news. 51. Please kill it. Thank you. Let's get Jennifer up in there. 58. Yeah, we're not really going to be able to do much with that. How about... Yeah, mm, yeah, it just sucks. How about Lucia? No, who's at the front? That's Anna. 95. That's good enough. Go. And you may die. Okay. You may die because, you know, who knows what's going to happen. So, Kwon is probably going to finish the job here because he does damage for days. And actually, he used the wrong weapon there, but that's, that's fine. Wow. There we go. The hit chance was remarkably bad. I, I did not like that. Okay. 50%. Are you seriously not going to get a... Oh, you are. Go, go, go. No crits. Oh, free hit. That's what that was. Good work, everybody. Yep. And now proceed to perish because of the poison. Let's see what I can do about that. Thank you for the medical attention. No problem. Ah. That's... Oh, yeah. You guys are going to make that sound now, are you? Uh, this is fine. I think Danny's gonna need a little bit of healing. Much obliged. Mm-hmm. It's kind of weird that Party Pal doesn't heal us out of, outside of the outside of combat, uh, which just points more to the need of a, a a button that starts combat because we don't have one, and you know it would allow Party Pal to to heal us. Okay, eh, just heal everybody. Why not? Because we're still gonna fight the big boss in the area. Ready to continue. Yeah, well, you're going to be complaining for a little while now, because that thing lasts... What the heck? I didn't do nothing to the camera. I'm not doing anything to the camera. I just told you to loot, and you went over there, waited two seconds, and then zoomed in a little? Ooh, that was a key there. What was that key for? It was for the sauna maintenance. Because, you know, that's Back where we are. Hunt. In the... Fa so the fauna in the sauna. There's corpses at the bottom of the pool. Looks like the pipes lead from this room to the sauna. Does it? That is the key that we have. Hmm. Kitty. Oh. Polly's still alive. Did Kitty just die? 
No, Kitty is okay. Everybody's okay. Oh, I forgot about them. <laughs> okay, so we have ourselves a burn book and a little bit of money. A computer that requires a little bit of things. A breather gas tank. That's probably... Tell me that isn't a way to poison them. Because I've been killing them all this time. If this was at the beginning of the game, I would complain and say, Ah, no, I'm just going to kill them. But it would still make sense. If it... I say at the beginning of the game. I mean at the beginning, beginning of the level. But if it is... If, if, since it is at the end, hopefully it isn't a way to poison them. Let's see what happens here. This jury-rigged device looks like it was slapdashly ass assembled, held together by duct tape and spit. A gas tank, marked with hazard symbols, has been attached to pipes flowing out of the room. You can hear gas flowing into the pipes. Unlock and turn the hand wheel to halt the gas flow. Oh, okay, so it isn't to poison them, it's just to stop the other thing. Let's inspect the device more closely, though. The gas tank was not made to be attached to the pipes, and the jury-rigged attachment should be easy to break, but the gas might escape into this room. Uh, so we can unlock and turn... Yeah, that's, that's probably... Yeah, let's just unlock and turn the hand wheel to halt the gas flow. You deftly... Dep deftly... Mm -hmm. Unlock the hand wheel and rotate it all the way. The flow of gas has stopped, disarming... The device. Radio gas interrupted. Detecting. Detected. Terminating experiment. Said the radio, even though it didn't. Oh, that's the guy that wasn't going to survive the gas. Addendum added. The psychopath. Many, many psychopaths. Also, that computer was locked, and now it isn't. The computer display reads Sani Clean Pool Hygiene Monitoring System, version 1.021. It has been 3,700 and a hundred, that's, that's a lot of days, 37,000, I should say, and 162 days since the last water quality test. And uh, off the top of my head, that, that is 100, day, uh, 100 years, basically, more or less. It's a little bit more than that. Do you wish to test the water quality of the pool now? Yes, please. Commencing water quality test. Warning, high levels of human blood and other blood, uh, bodily fluids detected. pH level is normal, which... Is weird. Shouldn't it? Shouldn't it be higher because of the, 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 um, chemical. Uh, not chemical. The biological. Yeah, it shouldn't be. Well, normal. What does normal mean? Is it? Ac yeah, normal isn't neutral. So it is normal for a pool full of blood and in, in bodily fluids. It would be acidic, because of the, you know, any time you have. Um, I, I might be wrong on this, but I'm pretty sure any time you have the biological matter, it tends to acidic. And vice versa as well. As in, uh, if you have non-acidic places, it tends to not have biological matter. Because, it, you know, alkaline is bad for biological stuff. Do you wish to drain the pool? Well, under this these circumstances, obviously. Uh, yes, I would like to drain it. Commencing drain cycle. Warning. The presence of human remains in your pool may void your warranty. Contact customer service for details. You have warranty in pools? Man, I didn't know that. I thought you had to... Wait, that doesn't make any sense. Pools are built in, in 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 the place. I mean, they might have warranty for from the constructor and stuff, but it's not like something you buy. I, I mean, these ones are not. Uh, we got a Columbium barrel for for weapon things. We have a little bit of money for nothing because it doesn't matter. We have the cleanest and sharpest looking people in in the in the level yet, all dead down here in the pool. Everybody else is super gruesome and ugly, but those ones. They are sharp. Look at their dresses. All clean and whatnot. I mean, I guess it makes sense. They were underwater for them to be clean. It doesn't really make sense. Uh, but anyway. The war... Uh, the door is open. The gas has vacated. And a middle-aged man has ex exited the room. That's Eston Ward. What in blazes did they do to him? He starts coughing violently, then, after a brief pause, begins hypervent uh, hyperventilating and shaking. It appears to be a side effect of whatever drugs were in the gas. As in, whatever gas was in the gas. Because, you know, gas is drugs. Unless it isn't. In which case, it's just air. Because of the... That's how drugs work. Um, I'm going to tell him to concentrate on slowing his breathing down. Slowly, steadily, he calms down and begins breathing normally. His mouth twitches, trying to form words. That's not words. His brow wrinkles at the sound of his own voice. That sounds like his, his tongue is, is uh, uncontrollable, like maybe uh, numb. If your tongue is numb, then you wouldn't be able to control it. 
The gas looks, or the gas took his voice, but he is stable. There's nothing more you can do for him. He breathes very loudly in the microphone. He does. Uh, we got gas victims over here. The corpses of those who could not survive the sauna gas experiments have been piled in this corner. I imagine... Of, of, actually, wait, that doesn't... The experiments, right, right, that does, yeah. And, and also they, they, the ones that do survive get killed because look at all the bloody thing. Although these corpses are also pretty bloody, so they probably just, you know, make them bloody before they, they start the experiment. Didn't I mess with this computer before? I don't think I did. No experiments in progress. Oh, we could have probably opened that in another way then. By, you know, messing with the computer rather than with the guest things. Everybody shits! It's a lore book. Mm -hmm. That is indeed a very important aspect of lore. This dog-eared composition book smells like an outhouse, but its pages are packed with dense lines of chemical formula. What exactly are we talking about here? Everybody shits, exclamation mark. Open parentheses, but some folks need more help than others. Close parentheses. By Dr. Archibald Jakes, Esquire. Everybody shits, am I right? You, me, even the patriarch himself has to pass his... Sorry. Park his ass in the outhouse and lighten the load from time to time. But sometimes what goes in don't exactly want to come out. Like them damn army rations you find from time to time. Sure, they'll last damn near forever, but you eat enough of them and your guts turn to concrete. Well, old Dr. Jakes has you, cover, uh, has you covered. Actually, is that true? I, I think that might be true, because army rations probably would be very poor, uh, very, uh, poor in fiber. And your body needs fiber to process the rest of the food. It doesn't actually process the fiber, as in, like, it's not fiber. The reason why veggies tend to be very low, calori uh, very low calories is because they're very rich in fiber. So you eat the fiber and it fills you up, but it doesn't get processed by the body, so it doesn't have any calories for us. Um, but anyway, and that's but it, it's necessary for you to poop well, as you probably know. Um, as Well... Old Dr. Jakes has you covered, exclamation mark. This book will offer laxatives you can craft yourself using commonly available resources. Sweets, glucose compounds found in fruits and berries are sure to make your cheeks burst. That's uh, C6H14 and O6. Those look like... I have no idea what these are, actually. Are those isotopes? Because it's glucose compounds. I... No, those are isotopes. Those are just the compounds for the glucose. That's one type of glucose. And then the other type is C42, H38, and O20. Yeah, salts. Also, sodium and magnesium compounds commonly found in ore deposits are guaranteed to make your neighbors call in a hazmat suit. Excuse me. They, they do also make the call in a hazmat suit because of the poop, but they will call a hazmat suit in because they need, they need it and they don't have it at hand. That's magnesium, sodium. Actually, that's not sodium. Sodium is Na. That is sulfur. And uh, O4... And then uh, sodium two, hydrogen two. That's just these are just uh, Na two. I th no Na four. Is that Na four the normal uh, elemental state? Because I I do know H two is the normal elemental state of hydrogen. It's also weird because it's H dash, so it might mean something else. Because in science, you need to pay attention to how you use your dashes and ellipses and all the things. Because uh, it's not like in video games where you can just use dashes as a coma. Don't think I don't see you there. That dash shouldn't be there. That dash should be a coma instead. Either way. Um, it's uh, And then uh, P, which is potassium, I think, potentially. Although that's my, that might be pH. Hmm. And oxygen. But that is uh, O4 again. So, again, it's not normal because it's O2 as well for oxygen. Uh, it might be H3. Hey, Rangers, this is Woodson. What's the status on the hostages? I said H3, but hydrogen might be H3 rather than H2. Uh, the Woodson, what, didn't you, what, are you still, oh, he was resting. I think he didn't leave that, that room. All hostages are accounted for. I see. So you located and secured all five hostages? Outstanding. Commander's gonna love hearing all about this once we get back to the Ranger HQ. Heck, he might even get a medal. Now let's keep your success going. Go take care of business with Victory Buchanan. Eyes sharp, Rangers. That's right. But uh, episode is done, though, because we're out of time for the day. So for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Wasteland 3. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.